Epson XP4200 printer. I'm going to show you how to do the Wi-Fi direct setup. So that is when we don't have home Wi-Fi network, we can use the inbuilt Wi-Fi of the printer. So go to the printer screen to activate the Wi-Fi direct. Scroll ahead and look for settings, network settings, Wi-Fi setup, select Wi-Fi direct, start setup. Click other methods. We are using Android phone, so select other OS devices. Displays the name of your printer Wi Fi, and below is the password. Now go to your Android phone, go to the Android phone, and open the Wi Fi. You should be able to see the Epson printer that is XP4200. Select it. Enter the password as displayed on the printer screen and connect. It's connected. Go back. Open any document you want to print. You can also add this printer in your Epson iPrint app. You can download the app from the you can download the app from the App Store. Once you download it, simply go to the app, select the home button, select home button again. It should display your printer XP4200. Click using Epson iPrint. You should be available. Your printer should be available here. If you want to print without adding in the app, even then you can do that. Simply select any document you have and click on the print button. So we'll see if it is printing or not. Now here is the paper output tray. So this way we can do the Wi-Fi direct setup for wireless printing. Once the printing is done, if you want to do scanning, you can just go to the Epson iPrint app, click on the scan icon, place a page on the top scanner facing downwards like this and click on the scan icon. You can save the file or you can share it as a PDF or JPEG. Once you are done, go back to your Wi-Fi settings. Go to the Wi-Fi setting and select your mobile network and you are done. So this way we can do the Wi-Fi direct setup and we can use it for wireless printing and scanning. Thanks for watching.